Yo, what is going on, Guardians? I'm bringing a new video to you guys today, talking about the Tekken King and explaining it for us noobs out there, me included. As you can tell, I'm only level 23 in this game. Uh, I'm working on maxing my strength. That's probably that's what's what I'm going for. I go for zero intellect. It's not as important, but we're going to be explaining the Tekken King. Hopefully, I'll be able to pick up some new armor so I can get rid of some of these blues and greens that I have over here. I'm trying to level up my future war cult. They have the best shaders in the game, I think. So when I got rocking my crucible weapons. I got that fusion rifle is uh, probably my favorite. It's the Split Shifter Pro. Um, but yeah, so we're going to quickly explain it, and this is going to be a little bit of a live com. So we're going to be playing some intense missions on Patrol Venus. I only do Patrol Venus. Uh, I like it. It's better than the end game content that I've played so far, including the Vault of Brass and um, what is it, Crota's End? Yeah, so much better than Vault of Brass and Crota's End. So. Taken King's coming out, what is it, like a week now? Is that much time we have? Yeah, I think it's coming out the the 15th, 15th of September. Yeah, we're in September. So we're going to quickly, you know, talk about a few things that, you know, people haven't even realized about Taken King. So first off, what we can conclude is that, first off, we got to, you know, confirm some things. So we, we killed Crota with his own sword, um, which doesn't make much sense to me. Uh, cause, I mean, what sword was he wielding when we were fighting him? But, we, we used his sword, so, we ended up killing him. So, we did that, that's a truth. What else have we done? Uh, we can confirm that Omnigol is actually Crota's mother. Uh, divorced Oryx, Oryx is his dad. Um, which is why Oryx isn't here, cause, Oryx, uh, Omnigol had a restraining order against Oryx. That's the biggest thing. Omnigol decided that Oryx was a drunk and, you know, didn't need him around her or her, her son. So Omnigol was like, you know, fuck you, Oryx. You know, I, I can't have you around my son. They went to the courts, got a divorce, all that thing. The restraining order happened. So, and then we just killed, you know, Oryx, his son. He's like 16 years old and his mother. You know, right before his eyes. So right now, Oryx has been, you know, he's a drunk. He's been swallowed up by grief. And he's finally decided, you know, screw the law. I'm just going to go out there and I'm going to kill these guardians myself. So Oryx is on his way here. It's taken him a long time because, again, he's a drunk. It takes him a long time to pilot his ship. He crashed into a few comets along the way, as you saw in the trailer. I mean, here, just, just, just take a look at this. Okay, so as you can see, he crashed it into that, you know, that asteroid. Like, that, that's how you know one is drunk to the point of no return. When they, they start crashing their ship into things, I mean, that's going to leave a dent. You know, he probably doesn't even have insurance. So, Oryx is on his way, finally. You know, it's been about, you know, eight months since we killed his son and, his, you know, his ex-wife. Uh, he hasn't ever remarried, so... Oryx is on his way. He's bringing his sword. You know, another sword. Who would have guessed? That's probably where Crota got it from. Crota was a big fan of his father's, actually. That's why he had a sword, too. Uh, they both decided that swords are the way to go. Screw guns. I know the whole entire world has guns, and, you know, they can kind of shoot people from farther away. But I'm going to go with a sword because it, you know, up close and personal is how I like to get my, my stuff done. So Oryx is here. He's saying, I'm going to kill you guys. But, you know... At the same time, he is just completely retarded, and apparently he has a bunch of followers. And he's going up against the people who killed his son ever so easily by using his own sword while Crota was still using his sword. We killed Crota with his sword while Crota was using his sword. So, you know, of course he doesn't understand the majesticness of us, and so we're going to ride up on our pretty pink unicorns, and we are just going to ram it in his butthole. And... That's basically what's going to happen to Oryx. So immediately after we kill Oryx, you know, we have the raid still. So, I mean, it doesn't make much sense. How, what are we going to be fighting in the raid? Well, Oryx's brother, a.k.a. Crota's uncle, is coming. This is when it really gets interesting. I mean, it's like they get the entire family in here. Like, I mean, first off, we fought Calix's brother. You guys don't know who Calix is. the giant servitor or the giant testicle floating around in the sky. 
you know, we, we ended up killing him, and his brother came along because he apparently was pissed off. And I don't get why we're fighting all these, you know, family members. You know, I mean, I understand we killed Omnigal, which was Crota's mother, and everything like that. And But, you know, Oryx is... Okay, anyways, back to the point. Oryx's brother, he's on his way to avenge his brother's death and also his, his you know, nephew's death. So, what what's going to happen? Like, what is... What is this uncle's name? Like, I don't even know what his name is. I don't even think it's important. I don't think Bungie actually gave him a name. But we're going to fight him. And then after that, I supposedly I've talked to a few Bungie employees. We're going to be fighting Oryx's brother's mother, which happens to be Oryx's mother. So there's just a lot of family members that are all coming. Um, but Oryx is definitely, definitely the worst of them all. He's drunk. You know, he, he's not... He's not good with things. Like I said, he crashed. I mean, you obviously saw him crash his ship into an asteroid. I mean, he's outside. Of, he literally parked his ship in an asteroid belt around Saturn. I mean, who does that? that that's literally the worst possible spot for you to park ship. But uh, that's pretty much the Taken King for all of us noobs. I mean, we're getting a few subclasses. The Sun Singer for the Titans. And... Once we get that, I mean, that, that, those are the titans that are going to basically be around the sun. I mean, wh why would a titan just go to the sun? But, you know, we get these subclasses, but th that's pretty much it. That's pretty much it, guys. That's the Taken King for us noobs out there, and hopefully we'll be able to, you know, make it up to level 34 easier because this game is way too difficult. I don't have the time for the grind. All right, guys, if you guys enjoyed this upload, make sure you guys leave a like and comment. And I will be giving away a copy of The Taken King if we break 1k subscribers by the time Taken King comes out. So you guys got like 9 days for that. If you guys are interested, make sure you guys drop a subscribe. So, anyways guys, I will see you guys in the next video. This has been Xylo on Nerd Out, and I will see you in the next video. Peace!